I'm excited. Uh, you know, Jugs was always there in my career. I started my coaching in 1977. We've won a lot of baseball games. I've been fortunate enough to win a lot of trophies and win at the highest level, but hopefully uh, my reputation is that we, we win with class and integrity. I think that's one of my ultimate goals. I've seen many players that are dead red, fastball only, and they can put a show on in batting practice or off a machine when it's one speed, but the big revealer of whether they can hit or not will be the fastball changeup. So the fastball change is a great revealer of balance and vision, and for me, it gives you answers of whether a kid, when you're first seeing him and evaluating him, might translate into whether he's gonna be able to hit off a, a real pitcher. You know, it's one thing to be able to catch up with a Division I pitcher that's throwing low 90s, but the real determining factor on a college hitter, can you hit off speed pitches? In college, the largest percentage of pitches in RBI positions are off speed pitches. So you, you're, you're finding out if a guy is gonna be an RBI potential guy or not based on the fastball change technology. We call it Joe College right-hander or Joe College left-hander in one package we can address scouting reports and what we're going to have to face that particular day or that particular week or try to shorten the gap in some of the hitters' inefficiencies. You could work on one pitch or you can work on the contrast, slider, curveball, split, change, an easy adjustment, easy mobility. You can make a slight adjustment and go from a fastball to a slider. And We all have a level playing field across the country. We all have 132 days and we all have 20 hours. And so you take that particular hitting part of your day 75 minutes or whatever it is, uh, you don't want to waste five minutes of that wheeling a machine out, setting it up, getting it to throw strikes, and, and then the adaptability of that, you know, having good equipment or good baseball, so the consistency part of that comes out on what you're trying to achieve with the machine as well. Well, I think, you know, the other thing that I respect about Jugs is they've always made it financially friendly for Little League coaches. I have a son-in-law that has four daughters that play softball. He's got the, the one-wheel Jugs softball machine. Uh, it helps a dad who can't throw batting practice or wants to instruct, and it's a very affordable piece of machinery that's as good as it gets in the industry. Some of the other machines that have tried to duplicate what this machine provides are not nearly as consistent, and so I think Jugs is going to dominate the field uh, in this technology with the contrast of speeds and the different kinds of pitches.